welcome all to Vilnius, welcome all to Lithuania. And uh, for us as NGO, it's a very uh, great pleasure, a uh, very big honor to, to be a co-host of such uh, important workshop. And uh, indeed, uh, we are very grateful for support in organizing this workshop for WWF, first of all, HELCOM, and especially for Baltic Region Program. And we have very good platform for cooperation within the Baltic Region Program, and this is an excellent cooperation platform for NGOs. And we, we even wish that, for example, some agriculture ministries, ministers of uh, Baltic countries would have the same good intensive discussion, having the same good platform for, for, for cooperation, because we feel sometimes that there are some some lack of, of cooperation and I think we, we, we need to stress uh, necessity, necessity of cooperation in our workshop. And uh, we are also having as an NGO long uh, history, I think long history of working with sustainable agriculture. I just on the last weekend was sorting out my old archives, old papers in my summer house and, and suddenly I found a folder of documents and on the on the label on the back side of the folder was written a project on regulation 2079-92 and uh, most of the documents were dated uh, of the year 1998 so I realized that we started working 15 years ago with this uh, sustainable agriculture issues and still continuing on this so we feel like veterans. We we have to, well, our organization is, is a little bit more than 20 years old, and we're working on agriculture for for 15 years. So <laughs> it's a it's a it's a logic continuation what we do now. So again, agriculture, of course, is is uh, as as uh, uh, we stressed, and many people will stress during this day, major single impact to the eutrophication of the Baltic Sea and it needs urgent actions of course and we apply a lot of efforts I understand and the, the even more efforts will be needed in the future in order to to reduce a special eutrophication effect and we know that these these effects uh, are, are causing really terrible consequences like hypoxic and anoxic area which is of the same size as Denmark and South and Sweden it's, it's, it's a huge area and to some knowledge this area is still expanding so so we, we really have a big challenges ahead before I wish uh, all a good day successful and fruitful workshop